at Christmas time as a child, Carrie Katona claims that teachers looked down on her and made her feel unloved. Carrie Katona has reflected on her time as a youngster in foster care and revealed that it may be a really lonely time for kids who are forced to spend Christmas with strangers. The 42-year-old Atomic Kitten actress said that she occasionally felt unloved as a child and that the stigma associated with being in foster care followed her to school. Christmas can be a lonely time for foster children, she writes in her special piece. You question, is it my fault? As you feel neglected, have I violated any rules? And even while you're in school, that stigma follows you. Many teachers treated me as though it were my fault and that I was a misbehaving child, Carrie continued. I wasn't in a foster home because I was a bad kid, rather, my mother chose her abusive boyfriend over me. That wasn't my fault, she continued. It was intimidating to use the restroom in someone else's home. The mother of five continued by saying that ever since starting her own family, she has made sure all guests are made to feel at home. I believe that's why I'm so outgoing and inviting anytime someone comes to my place, she remarked. I'll say, take off your shoes, unwind, and put on your pajamas. Given that I am familiar with the situation, I want them to feel truly welcomed. I grew up with four different sets of foster parents. I am the best qualified person to describe how it feels to have to live with strangers. Carrie then explained to us how, despite being preoccupied with the panto, she is eagerly anticipating spending Christmas with her family. But after contracting the virus, the celebrity hasn't been feeling well. The singer uploaded a few photographs on social media lamenting her condition. With one message reading, this is what an aging ex-pop star full of flu looks like. When Carrie first described her health anxiety, she said, I was lying down in bed and I felt like I couldn't breathe. Carrie admitted that before asking for medical assistance, she felt like she was going to die. I've scheduled a call with my doctor, but I'll visit any if it becomes worse. I have health anxiety and I'm very afraid, explained Carrie.